I'm Aaron Pritchett, and this is Around the Yard at NNS. A flex of muscle and a display of strength. An aircraft carrier like John F. Kennedy's CBN-79 definitely packs a powerful punch in more ways than one. And as the second Ford-class aircraft carrier continues its journey towards delivery, there are plenty of important features and capabilities that are being put to the test by the shipbuilders that are responsible to ensure that she's ready for whatever may come her way. This is an uh, aircraft elevator. Takes the planes from main deck to flight deck, and this is a, it's a new system on 79 compared to 78. And we've learned a lot as we go on from elevator to elevator, try to improve the process and, and, and speed it up. It's exciting to see things move in, into operation and to, to see these guys who uh, have worked on it from the start um, and have never operated anything to get to operate and see what they've built and see how these things work and, and get into testing. The capacity and what these things are capable of is, is unbelievable. So, you know, it's uh, very critical to getting planes up, up and, and down, and it makes you feel proud to see what we can do and what we can accomplish and, and the people we work with as, as we continue on. The NISM system, NATO Sea Sparrow missile launching system, and it's a ship's defense mechanism. It's very exciting. There's been a ton of work, I mean, years worth of work from from concept to the build and test phase that we're currently in, you know, structural modifications. These changes for NISMs came into the build. It wasn't in the original scope of work. So we had to go and, you know, redesign and implement all the changes to be able to bring this system on CBN 79. 